What's up? It's your kid and your boy, and I'm back at it again with another what the fuck. Oh man, not again. Moment. So look it. Like I told y'all, I was cheap, but like not cheap, cheap. Like, ugh. like, look it. I'm just gonna tell y'all. This man, he has food up in the jacuzzi. Now this probably be very weird, or like probably like psh, next level. Like, take you know what I'm saying? Like, right, let's get into the video. Online dating service. Todd was not paying for it, and I was paying for it. Red flags. Huh? <laughs> I, I realized pretty quickly that he was different from anyone else I had dated before. One Christmas, Todd bought me Doritos and chocolate chips for Christmas. And I cried. Hard. <laughs> Why did she cry? Because it was like I think wonderful. My get to her after a while. She would what? sometimes joke and say that she was on the crazy train. You know, pun intended, since I drive trains, she got off the crazy train. But I'm running the train, I'm going straight down the tracks, and uh, I can do whatever I want. Well, right now, uh, I've got some uh, clothes uh, in Ziploc bags. I don't have to put them in the washing machine. It actually kills the bacteria by having them in here. That way, I save on uh, laundry detergent, I save on time, I don't have to use electricity to run my washing machine. I've had clothes since high school. Can you believe that? Okay, this is... Uh, pair of jeans okay this pair here hey, that's crazy because i was watching buddy talk like looking at it but i didn't know this nigga said he was freezing his clothes at it like <laughs> i was watching it but i was just like but like what he talking about like he good like <laughs> hey yo we back at it i bought these 15 years ago look at that like brand new yeah like I, like I just bought them. The average refrigerator uses around 350 kilowatts of electricity per year. By tightly packing his fridge with clothes, cookware, and canned goods, Todd cuts his energy use by nearly 10%. The refrigerator doesn't cycle on as much, and it doesn't produce or uh, consume as much electricity. Just pack up your fridge with uh, anything you can find. I don't care. I don't care that some people might think that some of my habits are over the top now. I mean, I got clothes in my refrigerator, for God's sake. I mean, it's that's pretty cheap. <laughs> that's cheap. I ain't never that's seen nobody do that. That's one of the things about that. Todd is he doesn't care about comfort. He cares about saving money. Yeah, it's like comfort, money, and it's like, <sighs> shit. There's no need for me to use the washing machine because it just costs too much money. I could just reuse the water right here. There's a lot of wear and tear on your clothes in the washing machine. I'm able to wash my clothes in here. My, clo my clothes last for years. From a real estate standpoint, hot tubs are considered personal property and do not affect the resale value of a home. Uh, I just put a little bit of soup in my uh, plastic container, and uh, you'd be surprised at how quickly it heats up. I mean, right. people probably use their microwave every day, and that adds up to 40, uh, almost $40 a month. It's almost ready. I just want to know. Top's not going to add any value to the house. I just like, like honestly, I just want to know, like, how he wake up and was just like, yeah, this is the wave right here. You know what I'm saying? Like, like how he knew that that was gonna be the wave before the wave. You know? Shh. I still ain't gonna do it. We ain't eating at his house. To use it for multi purposes, for everything that I can think. He just cleaned his car. It costs about fifteen dollars a month to, to take a ten-minute shower every day, and that adds up. By using my hot tub, I would say I'm saving about thirty to forty dollars a month. That way, I don't have to use my appliances. I can turn off the hot water heater. This hot tub, I mean, it, this thing is a money saver. I mean, this is like a cash bet. cow for me. Bet. I think it's a stroke of genius myself. I bet. I think that all of Todd's free time is spent preserving the value of things that he has. Yeah. I'm uh, planning on selling this car, and uh, well, drive I want to try to get the best deal I can. This car is 10 years old, and you would not know that by looking at it. If I were to sell my car, I think I could probably get 3000 for fair condition and right. 6000 for good condition, easily. You need a hubcap. I've got plastic not only on the uh, the dashboard and on the steering wheel, but I've got ah. it on the seats, I've got it on the floor mats. 
most cars get a lot of that weathered look and a lot of the sun just bleaches a lot of the plastic but i don't get that in my car my car is yeah. just perfect i mean it's as good as the day i bought it all right i have no idea how todd is able to drive in that car i don't with know that either plastic. but you be in that bed with him huh? he has no pride <laughs> I just want to know what she saw him, but I was drying some clothes in the dryer, and I thought, why am I spending money when I can just, you know, put them in the back of my car and dry them in there? And I did it a couple times, and it worked like a champ. I think the clothesline in the car is ridiculous. Don't, don't you still pay for gas? Dry his clothes in the damn dryer. Oh, like, don't you? The average car in on a warm day can soar up to about 150 degrees. All right. It only takes about two or three hours for my clothes to uh, dry in the back time. Air drying saves Todd 45 cents per load of laundry, nice, huh? or approximately $100 a year. Right. And, I mean, to me, this is like really the only way to go. Each of my stops each day is contingent on timing in order to get the best deals and the best bargains. Grocery stores usually discount near expired food toward the end of the day. So Todd right. has this thing where he goes to the store and he peruses the fish and meats and looks at the dates. So he'll buy all the the fish that's on clearance that they're about to throw out and he eats that. That's disgusting. You be eating Buying it with cheap? No, she a liar because she can't just be saying like, oh, that's disgusting. Like, I bet you if he call you over like scoot scoot, you about to be eating the fish fish. Like, stop playing like. Why you don't do buddy like that? I bet you we I bet you that when we hit play, we gonna see Shotty eating that fish or the whatever old liar. I find a good deal, I feel really good. It uh makes my day. Got any uh good deals on seafood today? I do. What you looking for? Anything that's uh gonna be half off past free. The expiration date? Do you have anything that's old, anything expired? You know, if the packages are broken open. I'll take a look. There you go. There's a the deal. See that one broken? Yeah. You can have it for half price. Right. What about this one? This one's looking a little brown. Yeah, go ahead. I'll take that for 99 cents. How's that sound? Yeah, it's kind of kind of <laughs> cheap. What do you give me on that one? I see a lot. That one looks like it's been right. opened up. That's cool. 99 cents. I'll take that for 99 cents. What is this 99 cents? <laughs> That's probably in the 1950s. Oh, God. 99 cents, shawty. How old is this? Is there an expiration date on this one? You want 99 cents? 99 cents. Go for it. Yeah. I estimate that I probably save about nine, nine, $75 dollars a month on expired groceries that most people don't want. And uh, I can save me up to about $900 a year. When I'm satisfied knowing that it's the lowest price I can get, then I buy it all. Throw it in my all freezer right. and yeah, I'm, I'm living like a king. Yeah. Hey. any free samples hey. going on? Yeah. Hey. I got chocolate for the women customers, but go ahead, man. Go ahead. Uh, get something for free, it's great. Yeah. Uh, I mean, Talk I, your shit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Shout out to Buddy right there. Because, like, man, I feel like I'm doing anything, anything to get anything for free. Like, psh, I don't care. But I ain't eating no old meat, though. Like, no, no. Like, psh, treat your body like a temple. Yeah, like, no. <sighs> like, some of his methods I was rocking with. Like, but when it comes... Yeah, none of his methods I was rocking with, and I'm not about to eat no old meat to stay cheap. No, no. Hey, yo. Hey, until next time. Legendary.